Dude, I had a lot of fun with this chapter, all right? Yeah, we're still playing catch-up on these Black Cat reviews. You're going to have to bear with me, man. You're just going to have to just be like, Eliza Bar, why are you talking about a 20-year-old manga? I'm talking about a 20-year-old manga. And I'm, I went back in time to talk about chapters we somehow skipped reviews of because this is great stuff. This comic, this manga, is a lot of fun. All right, if you remember the last chapter, I told you, she gets out. She gets loose, and she runs into our partner right here, our homeboy, the uh, slightly less superpowered guy. Although we don't really know what a superpower is, he might be just as superpowered. They haven't really showed it off at this point. But he wears a hat. He's a cool guy. He sees a little kid. Hey, you're not lost, are you? Hmm. Hmm. Chapter seven begins. Train is running for his life. He's actually really smart. He's hiding out in Don Corne uh, Torneo's place. And we learn one really fun thing about him. Uh, he's like Ethan Hunt. As part of the chase, as part of the scheme he's got going on, he makes a mask on the fly. Like, I don't know how that happens, all right? I was just watching uh, the Spy and Family movie, right? And the guy, like, beats somebody up and immediately impersonates them and puts their face on. Like, how does that work, dude? There is no way you literally prepared hundreds of masks ahead of time and are carrying them around. So how does stuff like this happen? I don't know. But it's played for fun here, and I don't really mind it. Uh, back to, uh, what's the guy's name? Sven, right? Svenny, something like that? I don't remember. Him and the girl. One of the things I said... One of the things I really liked in the last chapter is she gets out. She's showing how she can grow as a person, how she wants to be independent of the evil mobster that's controlling her life, how she can develop and grow, become her own person, become more than just a killing machine. She's got this innocence to her, you know? She rolls out there. She gets out of the place. She meets our guy. He takes her for ice cream. What is it? Something interesting over there? Here, we'll eat these and figure out what to do next. It sits down. Great, a dangerous man like myself reduced to sharing ice cream with a little girl. What am I supposed to do? I can't just leave her here. This. You can eat this stuff? And I just like the cat in the background. I'm like, what? <laughs> like, the cat's kind of expressing, like, what his view is. This is how he's supposed to, like, his look. Except it's the cat in the background. So he doesn't look foolish. But his emotion still comes across in the panel. Uh, anyway, they hang out for a little bit. Uh, the Don goes looking for her, of course. Meanwhile, our homeboy is still in the Don's mansion doing stuff. There's a panel. Where is it? Uh, oh, here we go. Yeah, see, dudes are chasing him around. Dash, 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 dash. So he's leading him on a merry chase. He busts out that mask foo on somebody. All kinds of great stuff. It's showing the versatility of our main character. The kind of things he can do. He's more than just, oh, I shoot people. Lol, JK. Here's a kitty, uh, kitty smiley face explosion, you know. He's got more than that going on. He's got other skills. He's got this inhuman jumping he showed us in the last chapter. He's got that mask thing. Uh, his cleverness. It's great. And then the other guy. Is showing off his humanity, his compassion, his caring. This little girl. That little girl is alone. That little girl needs help. And he's not abandoning that little girl. Instead, he's being very kind. He's getting her ice cream. These guys don't even have money. He's buying her ice cream. This is the right thing to do. You know, you can tell a lot about a person by how they treat animals, how they treat old people, and how they treat children. And if somebody is nice to all of those, they're probably a pretty good person. Anyway, that was Black Cat, Chapter 7. In case you can't tell, in case you didn't know, in case it wasn't clear from this or other reviews, I'm digging all this stuff super hard. You all take care of yourselves. You have a great one. Hope to see you again next time. Until then, bye-bye.